Okay, we should be in A1 condition. No hurt limbs, no radiation, no diseases. We're not thirsty, we're not hungry, and we are not sleep deprived. This is the best shape we've been in since we started the game. <laughs> and it won't last very long either. Welcome back, everybody, to Fallout. We are playing uh, The Tale of Two Wastelands with the Capital Punishment mod list. And uh, uh, after I got back to the garage from, uh, you know, from the last episode, I, I kind of put some stuff away. And um, everything that I currently have in my inventory, we need to take and go sell. And so we need to sleep to level. And then what we're going to do, actually, before we sleep to level, we're going to actually get started with the fix up of our garage. So if we go into the workbench and we scroll down to Springvale garage cleanup, we need uh, some wonder glue. I already have hacksaw's tools and we found a sledgehammer in the last episode or two. So let's go into here and uh, this storage has all of my ammunition that I'm hanging on to my ammunition parts and all of my crafting stuff. So we need a wonder glue. I think we just need one of those. Whoops. Let's try, uh, look at that again. Yeah, this one. Okay, so I think what happens here is we click on it and then I, it, I think it takes some time for it to actually clean up. Let's see. Uh, oh, oh, actually it says that right there. Yeah, four hours. Spring veil, oh. Well, look at that. Nice. Okay. So we cleaned the garage. Now we need to find replacement fuses. Oh, yeah. There's a power substation to the northwest that might have some industrial fuses. Okay. So that's the next thing on the list that we need to do because then that'll get the lights turned on in this place. But, yeah, it definitely looks cleaner. Um, the I don't think anything happened up here. Oh, geez, that's taken a million years. Uh, are we going to get a crash? Nope. Okay. Yeah, so this just goes up onto the roof here. I don't know why that took so long to, to load. That was weird. And we still can't get down here. We'll, we'll eventually be able to get into this room, which I think is a hydroponics place. You know, once we get continue working on the quest but yeah it definitely looks a lot cleaner in here so that's good hopefully it didn't clean up the mattress that was on the floor no it didn't okay all right so we're gonna sleep and level up so let's do that next it's 10 49 p.m let's get up at 6 49 a.m get nine hours of rest you sleep soundly okay so we have eight skill points to spend there are so many things that we need, but I think I want to keep focusing on guns and repair for now. I mean, well, you know, it's like any other Bethesda game. When we get close to the end game, you know, we're going to pretty much have lots of points and be good with everything anyway. So... Um, you know, I, I think I want to just get better and better with guns mostly and repair. Uh, we definitely need better medicine. We definitely need better lockpick. And we need better explosives, if for no other reason, so that we can disarm the bomb and megaton. And barter would be good, too. So those are the ones that I really want to focus on. Sneak's not bad either. Um, we're not really relying too much upon charisma and that sort of thing in this playthrough. So I'm not super worried about speech or that sort of thing. And um, science is kind of secondary too. We're not, we're not really going to be heavy into hacking and stuff like that. So let's do this. Let's get repair up to 25. And um, let's get guns up to 30. And maybe we will put... 
another point. Um, let's see, barter, science, sneak, speech. Maybe we'll put this last point. We'll just kind of start working on getting... Uh, let's do explosives, because I have been using a lot of landmines and grenades and stuff lately, too. Very good. Okay, so that gets that done. And then we now... We could go with gun nut level three. We have two right now. Uh, with each rank of the gun nut perk, gun spread is reduced and item condition is increased. So here again, I want to just keep focusing, I think, on on guns until we get really, really good with them before we start work, you know, working on other things. All right, very good. That takes care of our leveling. Let's take a look at our condition. So we still have Hydro Withdrawal. We're pretty thirsty, but we're good on food, sleep, and not terrible on radiation. And maybe the dock can help help us with some of that stuff uh, when we get into Megaton. But it is definitely looking cleaner in here, for sure. All right, well, let's, let's go ahead and head on over to Megaton then. All right, Lucky's back here, but I don't know if his inventory has reset. Let's just take a look. Please, please. Enjoy my selection of high quality problem solvers. Yeah, he's only got 29 caps. The 308s would be good to buy. Uh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Cancel transaction, yes. Until we meet again. Here, let's put our. Oh, we already have the roving trader outfit on. Okay, never mind. We're good. A wanderer without a weapon does. Please. All right, so we're gonna buy selection of the 308 problem solvers. Um. We can buy those from him for free. I guess so. There's not enough to charge anything. Let's get the rifle powder and let's get the 20 gauge hulls since they don't seem to cost anything either. All right, that's good enough. Now to sell to him. I'm going to sell this cleaner's submachine gun because we have the 10 millimeter sub. Well, let's actually look at this, I suppose. So this does 112 DPS and eight damage. This does 111 DPS and 11 damage. Hmm. I mean, that, that does more damage damage per shot but one less DPS which one's in better condition they're both really close this one's more valuable and it's also got mods on it too yeah let's let's just sell the cleaner submachine gun then the police shotgun is not as good as the combat shotgun because the combat shotgun does 3.7 times 7 damage. So 3.7 per pellet. And the police shotgun only does 3. I don't know... I, hmm. I don't know if that's taking the condition into account, though, actually, now that I think about it. But, I mean, they're both very similar. So I think we're going to... Plus, this one has the drum mag on it anyways. Because this only holds five rounds and this holds 12. So, yeah, for that reason alone, we're going to sell the police shotgun. I'm going to sell all of these throwing knives. Oh, shoot. We're already... I've, yeah, we're already over the limit there. Huh. All right. Well, let's see. If that's the case... If we pull the police shotgun back and the cleaner's submachine gun, we can sell that probably to Moira. Give him the police shotgun back anyways. Let's accept that. And he's got 36 caps left. Sell him a couple darts. I don't use those. The mini nuke will sell in town. This is just an extra 10 mil pistol that I'm going to sell. We need to get our cowboy repeater repaired. Our sniper rifle's not in too bad a shape. Sell the cleaver and the machete. Let's accept that. 
Okay, he's got 16 caps left. We'll do the Psycho Tick and the Pain Spike. And... The Blast Master. And that should... That's even. Okay, good. So we end up with 423 caps. Thanks. Thanks, Lucky. Until we meet again. You stay safe out there. All right, let's go to the dock first. Can we repair these yet? Repair of 30 or higher. Yeah, not quite yet. We want to do that too. Oh, what? No, 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 no. Sorry. Who the fuck said that? I don't know. Uh, is it? It must be too early in the morning for him. Is that the case with Moira too? Let's go see. Yeah, she's she's not open yet either. Okay, it's a little too early in the morning. Well, the food place is open. Let's see if they have pure purified water. And the resplendence of the promise of our division. So what's it going to be? Um, what's on the menu? Have a look. She has dirty water. Damn. Okay, well, I'm going to sell iguana bits and dog steak to her. And, uh, problem with dirty water, of course, is it's going to probably give us disease. Wild punga fruit? Refined punga fruit. Hmm. I don't even remember that from before. Mire lurk. There was one of the mire lurks that gave you water. Was it the special? It gives three rads, but it also gives three H2O. Thing is, those we're not really that hungry. Oh, steamed mire lurk. That was the one. It's it's cheap. Let's buy it, and it doesn't. It's only got one rads, and it gives us both hydration and f and food. This gives us thirty strength. Uh, no, sorry, thirty water and one strength, but it also gives three rads. Okay, well that's about all we're gonna do with her then. Come back if you're still hungry. Have a good one. Oh, and we crashed. All right, guys, we're back. Uh, I went to, I, I reloaded the game and then went back to Jenny and did the same transactions. Bought the two Meyer Lurks, steamed Meyer Lurks, and sold a couple of things of food. Uh, we are now in the water treatment plant. And what I'm going to actually do is I'm going to drink this water because it's free. It is going to probably give us diseases and ra more radiation. But the idea here is that we drink all of this water to take get our hydration taken care of or i should say our dehydration and then we go uh see the doc and have him make it all go away for caps because that's how we do okay so let's see we are currently 366 thingies of dehydration so uh, we get 25 per on this so that means we're going to need four eight twelve about 15 drinks from this. Okay, here we go. Let's get ourselves sick. Mutant parasites. And drink 15. Okay. So, that should take care of all of our dehydration. Perfect. Okay, now what we're going to do is go see the dock and make it all go away. Let's actually stop in and sell a few things to Moira first. How are those hot little potatoes? Um, okay, yeah, we've already had those conversations with her. Uh, what do you have for sale? Okay, so she has 235 caps. That's great. Uh, what I'm going to do is sell her, let's sell the mini nuke. All this liquid nitrogen. Um, I'm going to sell... I'm going to sell this Silence 10 millimeter pistol because it's in bad... Well, it's not in terrible shape, but it's 
in worse shape than this. This is, has a silencer on it and does more damage. Excuse me. I know this one does more bonus critical chance, but um, I just don't want to carry around two 10 millimeter pistols. So we're going to go ahead and sell that one. Um, we're also going to sell this cleaner's submachine gun because it uses 10 millimeter rounds. It does 111 DPS, but this 10 millimeter also it does 112 DPS and it's in, uh, well, they're at about the same condition, but again, I don't need two separate submachine guns. So we're, uh, we're going to sell that too. Okay. So that's 234 caps and that leaves her with just one cap. Now let's buy a couple things from her. I want to buy all of her 357 rounds for our cowboy repeater. And yeah, I guess we could buy the hollow points as well. Uh, let's buy all of her 10 millimeter rounds and all of her armor piercing 10 millimeter rounds. Let's buy all of her 20 gauge rounds. Uh, okay, so if we accept that, that gives her 115 caps. I think, too, let's... Um, I'm going to sell her these blood draw kits because they um, they do quite a bit of damage to us, but we will keep the blood packs. Let's sell um, a couple solvitols because that'll make us addicted. Uh, let's sell these throwing knives and the Badlands armor. We don't need any of that stuff. I'm not going to sell her any ammunition things. Okay, so that get, leaves her at 27. Don't hurt yourself. Now let's see what she can repair for us. You got caps for me? Then there ain't no problem. Um, I'm going to have her repair the backpack for 22 caps. And the cowboy repeater for 70 caps, she can repair it 29%, which is pretty good. That's worth 29 for sure. You know what? I need to check and see, actually, now that I think about it, I need to check and see if she has, um, uh, a weapon repair kit. Yes, she does. Good. Okay. So let's buy that from her. That gives her 156 caps. Now, uh, does she have any 308 rounds? She doesn't for that sniper rifle that we bought. Well, we have 17 rounds. Okay, um, now I have a bunch of extra energy cells that I'm just going to sell her for 156 caps. There we go. It gets her down to 16 and gets us up to 650. You have, any, you have a splint. Okay, let's buy a splint from you. And I've got two stim packs. And let's go. Let's see what the doctor has on those. Don't hurt yourself. Come back. Okay, now let's go over to the weapons bench. And I want to break down the ammo that we're not currently using just to get the parts. So that's 22s and 32s and 45s. We can make 357 magnum rounds for our hunting rifle up to eight because we only have eight cases. Uh, oh, no. Okay. So that gives us eight more 357s. Does she have any 357 cases? Anything? She does not. Okay. All right. Very good. Um, I'm going to go down uh, to the dock now and we'll get fixed up from him and then we'll be finished here in Megaton. All right, it's 9 o'clock. He should be open. There we go. Boy, you're glowing like a goddamn reactor core. <laughs> yeah, I am. You need help? I need lots of help. Okay. Uh, so let's go ahead and have him... Actually, let's, let's see what he has yeah? for sale first. I don't think I have anything I want to sell to him. He's got a bunch of stem packs. How are we doing on bandages? We have 16. That's pretty good. Um, doctor's bags are so damned expensive. Immuno boosters. Cure all disease and resist all disease. Oh, those would be good to have, actually. Because what we could do is... 
if we had to drink, you know, dirty water out in the field, we could drink it and then just take one of those to get rid of all the diseases. It wouldn't help with the radiation, but um, I'm not going to buy the purified water. Let's get a couple more splints. Let's see, we have three. Let's buy another th three, so we have six. Um, I'm going to actually buy these immuno boosters too. Stim packs, we have two. Yeah, let's let's wait and see how much he's going to charge us to fix us up before we buy anything else from him. You done? Okay. Good. So this should cure all of our diseases. Your vitals are fine, but you could use some stitches on those cuts. Tell you what. 50 caps, yep. That sounds good to me. Here, bite down on this. It'll help with the pain. How attached to your fingers Dude, would you Dude, personal say space. Oh, wait. Never mind. There it is. <laughs> Jeez. All better now, Dude, you big seriously. Baby. Um I... Get out of my face. I don't have All right, let's see. We need we need to take care of our addictions. I... That'll 50 be 50 caps, okay. All right. We got addicted to I, got some of this I know this is very stuff. awkward, but that it's kind of in a cutscene. you feel all over your body. That's my patented addiction be gone treatment at work. That's very nice. Um all better now. You oh my god. Okay, hold on. Oh. Get out of my face. Jeez. All right. Boy, you're good. Okay, now, um radiation. Sure can. 100 caps. Let's do it. And a quick shot. All done. All right. So, I think that's all we need from him unless I want to buy a couple more stim packs. I have 183 caps left. Uh yeah, let's buy Let's buy, like, two more of those. You done? Yeah. Okay, we should be in A1 condition. No hurt limbs, no radiation, no diseases. We're not thirsty, we're not hungry, and we are not sleep-deprived. This is the best shape we've been in since we started the game. <laughs> and it won't last very long either. Very good. All right. So, um, I'm going to head back to the garage and then um, have to figure out what we want to do next. So, I'll see you guys back at the garage. All right, guys. Uh, we are back at the garage and I got stuff put away and we're ready to set out. I used that uh, one weapon repair kit that we bought on my carbine. Uh, so, it is in really good shape at this point. At least in the best of shape that it's been in so far since I've owned it. And I think what we're going to do for the rest of this episode is we're just going to go back to that overpass where I started fighting the bandits uh, and then, you know, stopped because I was in pretty rough shape. And we'll just finish cleaning them out for the rest of this episode. And then, uh, you know, depending upon how our time goes, we will probably uh, wrap it up. And then in the next episode, we'll set out and start keep working on some of our main quests. So uh, we got... I don't know. I don't know. I think we got over maybe into that area, but there's still a, a pretty sizable group of bandits on that end of the overpass. So let's go take them out. Get some more loots from them. Uh, we did find that awesome sniper rifle off of these guys. That was the, the big prize for, you know, the amount that we did attack them up to that point. Oh, did I miss somebody here? I sure did. Look at that. Okay. All right. We'll get some loot skis off of them. Uh, that raider we already looted. And, um, there might, there might be a couple of more. Oh, what the hell? A hollowed out rock with 32 rounds, strange meat and mutilated organs. Uh, that isn't worth anything. And I don't want to be carrying those around. Strange meat, mutilated organs. That's a sus. I think we're just going to take the ammo and leave the rest of it. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, yeah, no thanks. Weird. I just happened to, to come across that. I had no idea there were hollowed out rocks with shit in them. Ah, oh, okay. Let us go this way. That's a motorcycle, I think, that killed me. That was so weird when that happened. 
So we should be good to cross all the way over to here. But now we need to start being careful. Oh, you know what else I need to do? I need to put my combat armor on. There we go. Maybe I'll... Okay, I might, if, if I remember, I'll try to remember, no guarantees. Um, I might switch to my regulator hat if we try and do some sniping. Can I get up on top of here? I can, okay. Let's get our carbine out. I know we didn't kill all these guys. Yeah, right there. Oh, God damn it, I did it again. No, get out of vats. I don't use vats, that's cheating. How do I return, right mouse button? Now, get down there, okay. They got a crippled head. Can you get up oh here? God. I don't want to die. Oh man, they're all coming after me. Whoop. No, no! What? <laughs> Keep hitting the wrong fucking button. No, I don't want to quit. Continue. Cancel. Shit. Now, reload. She's got to go down first because she's got a gun. All right, uh, that guy's running away. You're dead. Dead. Am I? Ah. I think you're dead. Frickin' comedy of errors, man. Good lord. Okay, let's get our sniper out and get prone. Okay, there he is there, or she, or... Okay. Oh, of course. There you are, you little bitch. All right, little bitch. Just ran out. I think your time just ran out. Don't kill me. Too late. All right, we're still in danger. I don't know where the other bad bat is. Okay, now it says caution. There's a lot more raiders up here than I thought there would be. All right, let's go to here and let's eat this steamed Meyer alert because that actually gives us some healing. Now will get some of our hit points back. We're still in caution mode, though. I just don't see anybody at the moment. All right, let's just jump down then. A combat ultra stim and a 45 pistol. Um, I just sold. Did I sell my? No, I didn't. Uh, did I sell my ammo? I think I did. That's in really bad shape. Okay. Well, there's some more rounds. A bandage and a shiv. A shovel? Okay. That was weird. Did we kill anybody back here? No. Oh, let's get our light on. I don't think we did because that other one ran back and we killed her, killed her over here. A couple grenades, grenade rifle. Okay. That all translates to money.
see if there's anything in this dumpster. Nope. All right, let's keep hitting the wrong button. Okay, let's go prone here and switch to this. I put my I put my binox away because we have this scope now. Just one less thing to have to carry. All right, I don't see anybody over there. Yeah, if you guys haven't noticed, I don't use vats. The only time I might use it is if I'm in a really, really, really tight spot. But as a general rule, I avoid it. I mean, seriously. <laughs> it's so cheaty. I've never used it in this game. Is there anything in here? Alright, just kind of basic loot, I guess. Stuff we can sell. Alright, well, let's advance. I do not see anything moving down there. I don't know why it does that blur thing. If it's somebody's idea of a depth of field effect, it sucks. All right, I'm going to say we've cleared the overpass. That's the elementary school down there. There's stuff over here. Trying to be careful where I step here. Dynamite. A bunch of alcohol. 22 rounds. Um, uh, long fuse dynamite. All right. Well, I guess that's it. Oh, look at that. A, a varmint rifle. That's probably a 22. Anything in here? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, I think that's uh that's about all there is. I probably should take a look underneath the overpass and just see if there are any more bodies maybe that fell off. There's a mole rat down there. I don't really want to waste ammo on, on that. Though. We don't need to. There's Big Town over there. So we've got Moira's minefield quest. We've got the Big Town quest to go rescue the doctor and whoever else from the mutants. And we're going to take a shit ton of explosives, grenade launchers, and missile launchers to, to that fight. And I think those are our two, two big quests at the moment. We loaded that guy down there, right? Yeah. Come here, mole rat. What the f trail trimmers? Are you fucking serious? He just barely touched us and we got diseased, of course. We came over around this place before, but it's got a hard lock, so there's no way we're opening that. That's an average lock.
This should uh, cook the meat for us. Some heads are going to roll. go down there or not. There's a big ship down that way and a bloat fly. Alright, let's kill the bloat fly just for XP more than anything. That's not hurting me, is it? didn't appear to be all right that's that that's that fort that we needed a key to get into I feel the views all messed up again all right I'm gonna run up to that that barn wait do we have do we have a vendor in big town I know they're missing their doctor. We're supposed to go rescue her. I don't remember if there was a vendor here or not. The more time I spend talking to you, the less time I'm watching for raids. Don't be rude, Flash. Um. Look, the only place to go is the town hall, and that's. There's no traders. Okay. Keep an eye out. Just the doctor. That we have to rescue. Assuming she's even still alive. Hey, we'll take a lawnmower blade. Uh, I don't think we can loot that without stealing. Alright, I'll be back. It's on the to-do list. <laughs> I am going to run up to this barn and just see uh, on the off chance if that, that other traveling vendor with the Yao Guai is still there. Oh, look at that. She is still here. Is this like your base of operations? Hey. Hey. Okay, hold on. Let's change over to our trader outfit. And let's also put our that hat on. Not that it matters. What do you need? Uh, what do you got for sale? Price is she has 128 caps. Okay, good. We, uh, okay, we definitely want her 10 mil rounds, and we got that 45, but until I can repair it, it's not really going to help us a whole lot. There's a 45. She's got some frag mines. I wouldn't mind some more of those. She doesn't really have a whole lot. Okay, um, so for you, I'm going to sell you... Railway spikes, nails. Uh, I'll sell you all of the alcohol, assuming you have enough money to buy it all. You can have the mole rat meat and the blowfly meat, not the maize, and the ant meat. Potato crisps are spoiled. We don't want those. You know, I should probably just sell this pistol. It's in such bad shape. I suppose I, yeah, yeah, you can have the Mauser. You can have the 22 long rifle varmint rifle, which isn't worth shit. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to sell that. We'll come across another one. We already have a grenade rifle back at the base, but I might hang on to that one so we have a backup. You can have the hatchet and the machete and the shiv. Oh, this is an actual weapon. That's funny. Uh, I don't want it, though. Okay, let's accept that, and that leaves her with 33 caps. Okay, that, uh, this armor's actually, I mean, overall, not in terrible shape. We're probably gonna have to sell that back at... Megaton. Okay, where does that leave us? Zero caps. <clears throat> okay, that's all we can sell her. We still have quite a few armor pieces here that are... Gonna bring us a little bit of coin in for sure. Um, and she doesn't really have anything else that I want. How many antiseptics do I currently have? 
I have eight. Um, I guess we could buy three more from her and then sell that. Tin caps and that. Nope, we can't sell that. What if we take that one back? Okay, there we go. That evens us out there. I mean, this 45 is actually not in bad shape. It does 52 DPS. But our... Um, that does 43 DPS. But that's also silenced, though, too. Yeah, I, I think that's all we're going to do. Okay. A pleasure doing business with you. Likewise. Whatever. <laughs> Rude. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm going to head home, sleep, sell this other armor off in the morning, and then we're going to head out and go north. We're going to look for this substation that's supposed to have some fuses to the northwest. We're going to stop at Seneca Station to see what the robot guy has for sale. And then we're probably going to go to the minefield and then the Germantown police. Whether we get all of that done in the next episode remains to be seen. Probably not, but that's our plan. So, All right, guys. With that being said, thanks, everybody, for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video. And I'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye. Hopefully nothing eats to me on the way home.